On this trip along the coast of the Black Sea, we were very fortunate. We are soon to come upon a scene that could happen only once in a lifetime. The Ajarian women of the Batum section are largely of Turkish descent and of the Mohammedan faith, and they have lived for centuries cramped by old family traditions. While many have torn themselves loose, largely through the efforts of the Ajarian Women's Club, whose activities have been ceaseless, today we are to pass a celebration of the unveiling of many more women, a celebration to further the emancipation of heavily veiled but beautiful Ajarian girls. On our arrival, we find the great gathering thrillingly addressed by the Commissaire of the People's Council. Other leaders tell these girls that their custom is ancient, that it was conceived when man's fund of knowledge was limited. Now was the time to uncover the face, to lift those black heavy veils, to enjoy all the new culture and education that is the right of every citizen. Look at those beautiful faces. Here are the women of the East unveiled for years in darkness, now in light, out of ignorance and superstition and into the new spirit of freedom. After the unveiling, we lingered to watch the joyous festivities. This was a great day, a glorious day, feasting, singing and dancing.